and girls! I am so excited for today's science video. We're going to be learning about reactions. Can you guys say reaction? Awesome job! A reaction is when one or more things come together, they combine to make something completely different. And today, we're going to be using vinegar and baking soda, and we're going to see what happens when we combine those two items. So, this is a super fun project where we're going to make baking soda paint, and then we're going to add vinegar afterwards. So, what you need for this project to make the paint, you need a bowl, water, baking soda, and food coloring. And then you need a paintbrush and paper to work with. And at the end, you'll need a spray bottle, an eyedropper, um, you can use a small cup um, to spray or pour the vinegar on the baking soda so you can see the reaction at the end. I would also recommend using a baking dish or putting newspapers down, doing it outside because this can be a messy project um, and this would be a great way to keep it kind of contained. So let's get started. I will teach you how to make the baking soda paint first. So I'm going to put my bowl down on my tray. I will take a tablespoon of baking soda like that, dump it in my bowl. And then I'm going to take a tablespoon of water and dump it in my bowl. Guys, if you want more paint, less paint, do whatever you want. It just has to be equal parts. And now I'm going to choose blue food coloring. So I have blue paint. Put some drops in. And then I'm going to mix it up just like this with the fork. And now I have blue baking soda paint. So I'll do that one more time, guys, with another color. And I'll show you again. Empty bowl, one tablespoon of baking soda, dump it in the bowl, and then one tablespoon of water, dump that in the bowl. And this time, I'm going to use red food coloring. So I'll have blue and red paint. And again, mix that up with my fork. And now I have baking soda paint. So I'll set these aside over here. I'm going to take my paper, put it down on my tray. I'll take my paintbrush, and I'll start with the blue paint, and I am just going to have so much fun and do any design that I choose. So I'll start with stripes maybe over here. And you kind of want a lot because you really want the baking soda to get on the paper. So you dip it in again, and you kind of have to mix it every time you do it. So we'll do that, and now I'm going to do the red over here, and that kind of turned purple because I mixed it with the blue. And we really want, oh, there we go. That was a big one. All the baking soda on the paper because the baking soda is what is going to react with the vinegar. So we'll do that, and then again, I'll add the blue, and I'm getting a lot on my paintbrush, and then I'm covering the whole paper, oh, missed a spot down there, covering the whole paper so that I can have the biggest reaction possible. 
And there we go. Now time to check out the reaction. All right, everybody, here is my painting. And I'll take my vinegar in my spray bottle and we'll see what happens when I mix the vinegar with the baking soda. Let's see. What do you guys notice about the blue? What do you see? Bubbles, that's right. When you mix baking soda and vinegar together, a reaction happens and bubbles start to form. Oh, that was a good one. Check it out. How cool. So, so fun. Can you hear it too? Nice job, everybody. To see how baking soda and vinegar react together even more, you can do a second part of this activity. What I'll do is I'll add some food coloring to my vinegar. Put the cap back on, twist it together, give it a little shake so it mixes up. And then I'm going to take my baking soda and just spread it around my tray. And when you have large amounts of both of baking soda and vinegar, a bigger reaction happens. So let's check out when we mix our red vinegar with our baking soda. Look at all of the bubbles that start to form. You can even take off your lid and you can pour the vinegar on your baking soda and see what happens. <gasps> that is so, so cool. Look how much it reacts when you pour it. So awesome. And you can keep pouring on the vinegar until all the baking soda is gone. That is so, so awesome. What a cool reaction. I hope you guys had so much fun learning about reactions with me today. And who can tell me what reaction happens when you combine vinegar with baking soda? That's right, it bubbles. Awesome job. Don't forget to check out the curriculum outline for more awesome reactions that you can do at home. I hope you guys have such a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. Bye everybody.